Um, it's, it's a co-production world. I think that's what it is, is that uh, the more that we can cooperate uh, with our uh, neighbors around Asia and around the world, uh, it will give our stories, it will give our films a bigger platform and a bigger audience. And you know, if, as a filmmaker, that's always what you dream for, is, uh, is for your story to reach as many people as possible. And um, I think today's forum, today's panel just showed that it's all about cooperation and co-production. And you know, it's exciting times. Mm, right, and how the two countries can work together yes, in right. a better way, like yeah. in, the, in the industry of film productions. That's right. Um, with my latest film, The Fisher, uh, we explore uh, a story between a Filipino fisherman and a Chinese fisherman. So another way of how the power of cinema can communicate and tell stories about two cultures that are close to each other. Um, it, is, it is also my hope and my dream that maybe the Fisher would also be able to show uh, in the cinemas here in China. Uh, so that China will also uh, be able to experience and hear uh, the Filipino stories. Uh, maybe another uh, positive step towards uh, collaboration and cooperation between the Philippines and China. Speaking of the two cultures, I've also noticed what you're wearing today, the, the shirt. Yes, yeah, so this, this is a Barong Tagalog, yeah, so from the Philippines. It's a kind of our national um, outfit that uh, you know, men wear. To, to formal events, so very proud to wear the barong here in uh, the Silk Road uh, International Film Festival. I like the patterns. Thank you very much. Uh, so hopefully the story of the Fisher will uh, you know, be a positive step forward for more stories about uh, Filipinos uh, and, the, and the Chinese uh, cultures uh, you know, together in one film. Yeah. Thank you so much for your time, Hao. Yeah.